What's up YouTube, Kid here, and I bring you guys a epic UU match again. It's a good friend of mine named Hitmon Lee Hater, as he's known on the Rocket Game Quarter, or Knocked Out 26. I won the OU match because I want to test out my new OU team. I don't really OU that much, so this is kind of like practice for me. And he agreed to help me test, and he actually brought a fucking stall team, so watch out how this turn how this battle turns out he leads off with the fortress i lead off with the machamp i substitute and i thought he was going to go for the still rocks on the first turn so i was going to encore but he went for the toxic spice so i just went away for the i just went for the dynamic punch to get some confusion and i kept dynamic punching and he kept he kept he keeps getting hurt by confusion which is good for me bad for him and i um he sets up a stealth rock before he goes down and I dynamic punch him to death. He sends in a uh, Skarmory and I dynamic punch that. That does takes a chunk out of Skarmory's health. But I know the whirlwind is coming, so my sub is gone. And he has one layer of spikes. He has one layer of toxic spikes and one layer of stealth rocks up, which is not good for me. This is actually a very bad situation I'm in. And he forced me out into a Gyarados, which puts me in an even worse situation. So I predicted him to to whirlwind me, so I just wanted to uh get waterfall for some damage but he brave birds i guess i don't i don't know why he does that i guess predicting me to switch into something and get some lefties and i waterfall again predicting him to war with me out again but he goes through the roost and i'm like fuck i fucking hate scarberries man they they just piss me off so much and um i I go for the dragon dance here, predicting him to spike. I just want to get some big chunk of damage out of that thing. He does go for a spike. And and by this time, I'm like, damn, I know the waterfall isn't going to do, kind of not do shit to that thing. So he wills me, wins me out finally, and I go back into my Machamp. And I get hurt by poison, but I have a Lumberry, so it doesn't matter. So I'm cured but with my poison. And... I predict him to he actually roost here. I guess he thought I would be faster. And I get a super effective dynamic punch because roost nullifies your flying ability. And I take a big chunk out of that. It basically nullifies the roost that he just did. And he's still in confusion and he prays for me, but because of the intimidate on the previous turn with the Gyarados, I'm gonna live that. And I'm gonna get a dynamic punch off and I'm gonna kill that Skarmory, which is absolutely good because that thing would have just screwed me over then he goes into a fucking mill tank i'm like god damn it how many walls do you have and he sides me toss me and i die and he switches out predicting me to stealth rock and he goes for a gyarados gets the intimidate off which is good for him and he stealth rocks and i'm going to roar here predicting him to dragon dance but he taunts me so i'm like shit it must be one of those bulky those bulky taunt Dragon Dance um, Gyaradoses. So he goes for a Dragon Dance and I Ice Beam just to see how much it would do. I Ice Beam just to see how much it would do and it does shit damage but I get a freeze which is very very good. That serves him right for bringing out those goddamn walls. But anyway, he gets a freeze which is good for me and I switch out going to my own Skarmory. I fucking hate Skarmory but it had to be done for this team. This Skarmory was probably the only thing that would fit in this team. So I. I want to whirlwind him out, and he goes for a dragon dance, I guess, predicting me to spikes, but I whirlwind him out into a mill tank, and I thought he was going to switch again, but he has, I thought he was going to switch again, but he thunder waves me, and I whirlwind him out, still trying to scout the rest of his team, he has a fucking shuckle, I'm like, oh my goodness. He has a whole entire team of wall. He's trying, to, like, he's wall whoring me right now, and he encores me. I'm like, oh fuck! And I whirlwind him out into his mill tank again. So basically, all I'm, all I'm just trying to do is just trying to scout for the rest of my team because I have a plan here. If I can see enough of his team, if I can get inf my infernape my infernape in safely, I can probably get off a sweep. If I can, if I can just see the rest of his team, but. Knowing since it's a, scar, a stall team, I know it's a Blissey on there. It has to be a fucking Blissey on there, cause Blissey is like, is is like the stall, the stall queen. So he knocks off that does jack shit, knocks off my leftover. I get pair, pair hacks, and he knocks off again, does jack shit, and I get pair hacks again. 
what I'm like, what the fuck? Can I just get the whirlwind off my encore and and I get I set up my spikes and I know he's gonna encore here, but I just want to get spikes so since he switches a lot, I just want to get spikes so um so I can get some residual damage. I spikes again and I know he's gonna switch into Gyarados here. So I just, I got greedy and I set up one more layer of spikes instead of switching out. So I I thought he was gonna taunt me here to lock me into struggle or something. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna switch it to my Scarf Tyranitar, and if he Dragon Dance, I'm Scarf, so I hope to outspeed, thinking that he is the bulky Dragon Dance one, who is adamant and probably won't outspeed me after a Dragon Dance. So I'm like, okay, okay, let me outspeed, let me outspeed, let me outspeed, please, please let me outspeed. And I don't outspeed. And I'm like, fuck, I, I was like, damn, I fucking lost, I only have like, probably, a cut, like a couple chances left, so I lose my tire in the tire for like, like absolutely no reason. I send in my uh my Skarmory. He taunts me. I predict a taunt and go straight away for the Brave Bird, which will be probably which will be a a definite two hit KO, especially when Sandstorm Storm is up. So I'm like, okay, I can live one more whatever he get. Just please don't let me get Parahax. Up. Please let me finish this thing. And I get Parahax again. And I'm like, what the fuck? Can I just not get Parahex, please? Jesus. And he just waterfalls me and kills me off. And I'm like, god damn it, man. This Gyarados is like fucking shit up right now. It's probably like nothing I can do. So I send him my Swampert to get an Ice Beam off. He waterfalls me. He waterfalls me, and I live with 11 HP. And an Ice Beam still doesn't kill. Sandstorm still doesn't kill. But now, this is where you'll see in a second this is probably like the most epic part of the entire fucking match I send in my grim job my infernape he's at low HP now so I kill it off with a life or vacuum wave all right so Sam Storm rages get hurt by poison and stuff I'm at so he sends in a mill tank and he switches out fearing my close combat then I go for the nasty plot and this is what absolutely won me the game right here I go for the nasty plot right here and I fire blast I'm going to fire blast that shuckle to absolute hell to straight hell fire blast kills that shuckle sandstorm rages and I'm hurt by my poison and he sends it a fucking blissy. But now, look at this. I have a nasty plot. I'm in blaze range. And I'm life orb. And watch this. Fire blast. This is like the most sweetest thing ever. Fire blast absolutely rapes that fucking blissy. I'm like, blissy, get raped. Stupid bitch. So, we're down to our last Pokemon. Mil Tank versus my Gyarados. And that Mil Tank gets raped by entry hazards. And Waterfall will take that thing out. So... Good game, hater. Uh, love to rematch you sometime without the walls. Like you really, or like you really wall hoard me here, and I like to rematch. Check him out. Great comments, right? Peace.